Hi guys, this is Ravenclaw What If. Welcome back to another What If story. Now, this What If is... I had some time to think about the story a little bit, so I have some... Somewhat I want to do with this What If. But we'll see how... How, uh, how this recording goes. This is a What If Deku Had a Guardian Seed Cork. Part Zero. Now, I did a... a my, um... On my update on this series, I explained a little bit of how the story is going to go, what I have planned, and the ones I didn't say on the video, it will be implemented into the story itself, so I don't want to ruin anything. It'll be easier if you watch that first and came and watch this, but you know, it's all good. Now, in this story... The percentage of corkless people or corkless in general is increased a good amount about 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 thirty to thirty five percent of the human uh, oh sorry the the general population will be corkless so none of our main characters will be affected so you don't worry about that I just need this for the background of the story so so the rose fields the rose fields saw money in this their um the rosefield family ha has always been head deep into um cork research that's a cork gene itself so they mostly, you know, get their money from that. They're they're pretty wealthy family. They're pretty, yeah. They're either an equal of the Yazirozus or a little bit richer. So Izuku's um, goal for uh, being a herald would be a little bit different here. Because I changed something in the story. So it changes the story all together. So. so scratch out if I told him he wanted this money for money's sake. Because he's rich, he doesn't really need it, so. As the road fields over the years found a way to actually give people corks. Using what's left over of their gene and using nanites to artificially give someone a cork. It repairs the gene. So the corkless person would have a cork. But each um but each process, the cork's a little bit different. It's a little bit weird. They're they're not normal like signs of a cork. Like at one point one of them had a fire cork, but it was a straight up silver flame. A lot of them have a lot of summoning, like lesser no lesser some Summoning corks like a uh, robotic wolf. One kid had a robotic raptor as a cork that follows his commands. So the government labeled everyone that had a um that has a artificial cork. They call them seeds. Then you had the daughter of the Rosefields, you know, sorry. <laughs> the only heir of the Rosefields family. Throughout the years, she did what she needed to, to do, get on her father's good side. As soon as her father died of old age, she took over the family company and decided to move her operations in Japan. Because they were a strictly American company. And her father didn't want to venture into Japan. You see, America kept the whole seed project in American soil. So, all seeds, are, all seeds come from um, the U.S. As Lilith Rosefield... Uh, you know, ran the company and t 
time progressed, as she aged up, as she took over the company when she was like probably 16, 17, and she's in her early, she's in her early 20s, as she's decided she wants an heir, but she doesn't want to go through the pain of childbirth and um, whole marriage aspect of it that she finds pointless. So she's so she's decided to use some of her DNA as a template to create a, a, a offspring using their facilities that she has. The Rosefields dabble in a whole lot of things, so they're able to, you know, create an artificial human if they wanted to. So that's what she decides to do. Now, Ezekiel wasn't, in this, Ezekiel is going to be um, born a seed. So he hasn't, he doesn't need to go through that operation because she would make sure that, you know, she would know that when he, he doesn't have the current, the current, uh, sorry, the certain pattern of the genome of the cork gene. So she would figure it out pretty fast that, oh, he, this much, you know, much child is going to be corkless. So, you know. Let's add a little bit of there and then that. And so he's going to be a straight up seed from the start. As, as Izuku Rosefield has grown up with his mother, Lilith Rosefield. And because he was raised knowing his mother made sure he knew that he was the seed. He was different from the rest of the seeds. He was, he was born a seed. That's all the information she she gave Izuku. So straight off the bat, being told that his mindset would be totally different. Like he's really nice to people with seeds. Well, sorry. He's really nice to um, seeds in general. He's pretty friendly with them, but he doesn't like um, non-seeds. Yeah, he generally um, considers himself from a different species than, um, than, than humans. That's how his mindset is. And he's totally not wrong on that, but... He has bright... Um, he has yellow eyes. They go bright when he summons his cork. Zero. His hair is long in the picture. Silver with um red, pretty long red streaks, like in a exactly in the picture. That's what he what it looked like. Oh, during his schooling, he didn't really have any trouble. He's like, he's a rich kid, so he straight up went to private academies. That's where he all. That's where he went to school. There was a mixture between um, cork and seeds. So he's all friendly to uh, seeds, but he's hostile towards cork people in general. He doesn't like them. As you have a plane take off, or no, land, as you see a private jet lands, as you see a couple of guards come out of the plane with a young, as Izuku walks out. He's like, as he's like, really? So this is, so this is Japan? Whatever. As, as a car pulls up, a limbo, as you know, yeah, a limousine, because you know, we're traveling, so he pops in. As the window of the driver, so where are we going? Your mother directed us to drive you to the to the head locate uh, the head base in the Japan branch. <sighs> Understood. Continue doing your job. As Izuku is irritated because he's. Getting a little bit irritated because he can't 
use a part of his cork that it just refuses to come out. He's able to use his, his blast, his red blast ability. But for some reason, his summon part of his, his, his seed. Because he, his mother told him he has a, a part of his abilities as, you know, a summon, either an animal, most likely an animal that she believes. But it just refuses to come out. Like, he, he knows he's able to do it. It says, whatever summons is behind that cell, or whatever he's trying to summon is refusing to come out. So he's getting a little irritated. As he gets to his mother's location, as he, get, he gets an elevator on a building, as it goes all the way up, as it, as it bangs, as the door opens, as, she gets, as Izuku gets to the main office where his mother is, as he knocks, come in. You wanted to see me, mother, with the whole, you could have called. Come in, son. Sit down. How was your flight? It was fine, Mom. The stewardess were a little annoying, but it's our, it, it, it was fine. How's your training? It's still, it's still not wanting to uh, obey, apparently. Won't even show up when I have. Haven't even seen it. Don't worry, son. You'll get a handle of this eventually. I have faith in you. Now, the reason why I had you fly out here, Japan, because you're going to be starting your first year of middle school soon, son. And you're going to be um, attending a middle school in here in Japan. As Izuku's like, why? As when as they continue talking, as whatever's on the, the TV, breaking news pops up. As it has a clip of a uh, a clip of All Might saving someone. As all both of you hear is, "Don't fear, I am here." And he does his smash. As everyone's freaking out, it's all my, it's all my, as, as over the TV and shit like that. As Izuku looks at his mother, who the fuck is all might? As she's like, she shuts the TV off. It's like the number one hero of Japan. All might. I'm not sure where his quirk is. As he, what you mean, number one, mother? Oh, yeah. They rank their heroes over here. As, as Izuku looks at his mother, they think highly of themselves. Interesting. How do you want, how do you want, to, how does one to go about being one of these heroes? As, as uh, Lilith smiles, that's the precise reason why I want you to go to school out here. As a seed, I need you to attend, I need you to attend UA when you get to that age. If the general population saw one of the seeds attending a hero school, they will feel less of ease. Some of the seeds have not always acted in good, uh, good standing of the rush as part of the law. And as a rose field, you have a reputation to behold. And what's better yet? And what makes it better that not only the head of the family is willing to, the oh, sorry, the Rosefield is willing to put their own son through the hero course. Does he ease the population's concern? Well, as easy he's like, so what school I'm going to? As he's interested in what school, as she's as as his mother speaks up, as she's like, 
I could send you any of the private schools around here. It would be pretty easy, but I think you need to make I need to make sure you're not going you're not soft with all the luxury that you've been raised with. So I'll be sending you to one of the worst one of the one of the war one of the more um sorry, give me a second. One of the schools will keep you on your feet as she smiles. The driver will direct the driver will drive you back to the house or well, our our house <laughs> in Japan. We'll talk more when I get home. As Izuku walks out the front door of the building, as he sees the limo driver, as the doors open, as he walks up to it, it's like, hey man, you in there? Driver. As he's as he sees a man, as he sees the driver, his head is on the steering wheel. Hey Amen. Wake up. As he sees a bullet at the back of his head. As he's like, shh. Or the other side of his head. Well, yeah, it's basically... His hat was blocking it a little bit. But yeah, yeah, he, he's dead. It's like, shit. As he goes out, as he f feels a sharp pain in his neck. As he look easy looks down as he sees the tranquilizer what's left of it when he rips off his 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 neck. It's like a fucking tranquilizer. Has some salt in. As he slams it out, as he's wobbling a little bit, he's like, it's gonna take a lot more than that to knock me down. You just cash the check that you can't <laughs> uh no no. Well let's see. You just made a la the last mistake of your life. I'm going to end you. As his eyes starts to glow uh, yellow. As soon as he is about to blast the snipers. As he... He's, he was just going to guess where they're at. Because he doesn't know where they're at exactly. But he was he was aiming at all the good sniper points. If he was a sniper, he's still pretty young still, so he hasn't started his first year of middle school yet. But he's well reversed in his abilities. As he felt sharp pains all over his chest, as is yeah, they shot a lot of um, tranquilizer at him, as a, a black. Black armor van comes pulling up, but um, tranks him some more. But the bag over a uh, uh I'm not sure, not a bag, but a um, a hood over him, and throw him in the back of the van of the vehicle and and roll off, and drove off. As Izuku wakes up in a chair, as his eyes are, his vision's blurry still, as his vision slowly returns, as he hears several men talking, arguing, as he finally gets his vision back, as the head of uh, the leader of the group that says doing this, I'll make this short, kid. If you're daring, <laughs> if your mother doesn't give what we want, give us what we want, you're dead. This business, kid, nothing personal. As the kidnappers get a phone call, finally, as he, he answer it. As I want to, I want to identify you actually have my son. Put me on speaker. As Izuku, you there? Yeah, mom, I'm here. Just waking up from the lovely nap they gave me, but I'm I'm good. As the as the kidnapper, as the kidnapper um, demands, I want the amount of money that that I told you I want, or the boy dies. 
Uh, she's like, hmm, I don't think so. As, I, as the um, kidnapper, what, you don't care about your son's wife? Oh, no, I extremely care. You honestly think this is not the first attempt someone of your lower intellect has come up with? Izuku, you could do with them what, what you will. I'll have it. I'll have it. I'll have everything covered up by uh, by my end, so our family won't get in trouble. Goodbye. This is the last time we'll be seeing each other or talking to each other, scum. Well, boys, you heard my mother. As they turn around, as they see him, he's out of his handcuffs. As he, he's in his poster in the picture. Seems like it's just me and you. Me and you guys. Try to make this fun. As he's like, don't worry, guys, he's still wearing... He's still wearing a collar. He's pretty much useless. As he's like... As he... Oh, this neat little accessory you gave me. Yeah, it doesn't work on me. As he as he uh, emanates a little bit of his um, red energy off his hand. See, I'm different. How is that possible? It's simple, peons. I'm a seed. As he blasts the two, vaporizing them from... Uh, as they blast to as all you see is a splatter of blood on on the ground. He turned his blasts uh, he yeah, he turned his en energy blast to like lethal levels. So yeah, he's not playing around. As he sees one of them pull out a um a assault rifle, as Ezekiel jumps over the table, holds on to it to turn it over. While in mid uh, flight, as he's using the table as cover, as the guy is shooting his um, assault rifle at the um, the table that Izuku's under, or he yeah he's um right behind. As the rest of the raw of the uh, kidnappers, I'll pin him down. Go be flank him and put a bull in his head. As that's straight up. That's how they're doing it. They're done playing games now. Now, they don't know what a seed is because that's a strictly American thing up in the States. So they don't know what it is, it is exactly. It's not very common knowledge. Only certain people will know it. The rich, all my and like hero organizations, they knew they know of it, but they've never, you know, seen one from themselves. Except for all might because, you know, any hero that went to do a miracle, uh, hero work in, in, in America knows of the whole seed situation there. As I think you burst in a sprint, appears in front of the guy out of nowhere. As all you just saw him, he was there for a second, and he was gone. And as he appears in front of him, as his, he has his hand into a fist, as his glowing energy. Technically jumped off the table, went in a sprint, then appeared right in front of the one on the right. The one in the middle has the AK. Another one has, you know, a gun. So does the other one. So that's how the left and right have guns. The middle has the assault rifle. Oh, sorry, guys. I messed up something. As he smiles, this is going to hurt as... He punches the dude in the chest as he goes flying. As he he slams into the, to the wall of the warehouse. It's all you know, like a cement type of deal, building. So as he's implanted in the cement, as he could rush over to the other guy with a smaller gun. As the the guy had enough of this, as he's he's in range to get hit by the by the assault rifle as he opens fires as he opened fire as Izuku's like shit bastard as he knows he he fucked up 
he should have took him out first. But he wanted to play with them for a little bit. Out of nowhere, Izuku sees this woman does appear as she reflects all the bullets from the assault rifle with with her um, energy sword, I guess you would like call it. Now, she regulates her blade for lethal attacks or just for stun. Or just for, you know, not for cutting someone's flesh off. But it gives you, but it gives the opponent a, a little kick. <laughs> so, yeah, it, it hurts. As she, as her head was down a little bit, as she looks at the, the guy, as she goes in a sprint, as the man fires, as she jumps up, does a backflip, unsheaths her sword, energy sword, cuts the dude's head off in mid-flight, um, as she lands on her feet, as she puts her um, sword back in her holster. As Izuku's confused, like, who the hell is this? As she calmly walks over to, to Izuku, as she checks on make she makes make sure he's all right. As she's like, before you ask, as she stands back up, as he's fine. I am Zero, your summons. Don't summon... Do not try to summon me again, kid. You are not worthy to summon me of yet. And I'll be the judge if I appear in front of you again. As Izuku looks at her, well, that's interesting. I thought my summon of Billy of my abilities would be animal base. Never seen this before. So, what do you find unappealing about me, Z Zero? As she's like, it's not your personality I dislike. As he's like, then what is it then? You're weak. I will not serve a weak master. As she disappears. As she desummons and go back to, you know, whatever, yeah. As he, that's pretty much what happens there. As Izuku gets a phone call on it, you know, he had his phone on him. They didn't really, they were, they were idiots. So he still had his phone on him. It's like, hi, mom. Is it done? Yeah, it's done. Apparently, um, my own summons told me I was too weak. So that's the thing. A little insulting. As <laughs> as little as um his mother starts laughing because that's uh, kind of funny. And she's like, "All right, head back to home." I told the heroes of the situation. They know what to do. About time you get at a warehouse. The officer said be there. You used to give them your story and all that. And. Yeah, I know, Mom. Self-defense. That's pretty much it, what came down to it. So, Izuku gave them their story. They took him down to the station. As the chief the chief officer dog, whatever his name is, Aruzumu or something like that, I just don't remember his name right now. At the moment, they gave him the question, and, and they fuck it off to um, self-defense. Because, you know, he, he did get kidnapped, but normally your the victim doesn't slaughter all the um, soldiers. And and he could always, and he could always say, he could always pull my, my abilities went out of, out of, out of whack. So he could always pull that, pull that line to get out of trouble. So yeah, he's not going to get in trouble whatsoever. And with um, the Roseville's influence, they have, they could easily get that, you know, buried under real fast. 
As Izuku finally got back home, as he walks into the manor that he lives in, or a mansion, or whatever, as he have um, Lilith, as she rushes over to check on a, on Izuku. Mom, you, this is not the first time this happened. I'm fine. And she's like, dear, I'm a mother. You're my, here, you're, you're my son. Of course, I'm a worry. But I know you're fully capable of handling yourself in certain situ situations like this. But a mother has, mother will always worry. As she wipes some of the blood off his cheek, as she's like, you need to burn those clothes immediately, by the way. As she's like, yes, mom, why don't you burn them? Then take a shower, then head off the bed. You have a pick of the rooms upstairs. Well, as Izuku, you know, does that. And... We're probably going to stop it there. Because I got to put this on series on the hold for a little bit until my two series, my two main series finishes off. So after that, after my two main series get completed, or when I end them, then uh, this one will take its place and one other one. So it'll, that's how that's going to roll, so... Catch you guys later.